You know, this was supposed to be done two months ago. Why did I not get it done? I don't know. Sometimes I just go through these periods where I just don't want to work on anything. And also, deep down, I hate the video. And I hate the photo. I hate everything. I just, I hate everything. Yeah. You'll see. You'll see. Just, we're going to cut to the intro. I, I actually have an intro already recorded back before the eclipse happened. We'll just cut to that and... I don't know. I just. Just, just go. What are you doing in here? Get out. Again, you're in the house. Get, get out of my house. I'm so sorry. I did not mean to break your neck. But here, let me rip your head off, though. There we go. Hello. How's it going? In the last video, I talked about 15 years. And apparently YouTube decided to recommend that video to people. Cause all of a sudden, it's got like 260 views. To you, doesn't sound like a lot. But to me, I don't share these videos anywhere. I upload them, I put them on the blog, and I put the blog post on my like personal Facebook page with a hundred friends and family. So I don't really share these videos anywhere, but I guess YouTube decided, this is cool, 15 years, awesome. Let's just send that out to a few people. There's comments on the video and they're like, who are you? And like, oh, this guy recommended to me. I'm like, I know, I just, I don't know. I don't know what's happening. Two people subscribed, why? I haven't posted in like forever. I did four videos last year. If you think this is gonna be good content, sure. You do you, but I do this when I feel like it. And for like the past four months, I haven't felt like it. That's why I've been gone. Hello to all the people who are watching. We'll see if YouTube recommends this too. Maybe we're on a train here, we'll see. I'm panicking. You can't tell, but I'm panicking. Can you tell? I'm panicking. What was I gonna talk about? Why am I doing this? What was I doing? What am I doing? Who am I? What am I doing? Where am I? I have no idea. We're gonna watch the eclipse at some point, but first, we have to update some things. So, in the last video, in 15 years, I mentioned Photo 500, because if you notice, the title of the videos are named after a photo. 499, 498, you know, so on. Because each video is the behind the scenes of each photo. And each photo is basically how I'm feeling at a certain point in time. So if I'm feeling dark and moody, like the last few photos, they've been dark and moody. So since the photos are about my life, the videos also have to be about the life, and that's why they end up being like a vlog. So you can see how I'm feeling throughout a certain period of time. And you can see why the photo looks a certain way. But in 15 years, I mentioned Photo 500 and how I've been stuck on it for the past year and a half. I just don't want to do it. I thought I did. Relax out there. In the New Year's video, I'm like, you know what? We just need to do it and get it done and get it over with, you know? Have I done it? No. Is it being done? No, so clearly something's wrong. Clearly, even though I said I wanted to do it and I want it to be done, I don't want it to be done. And we've been stuck on it for so long now, it's causing a problem. So I'm making the decision to move on. I'm moving on. I obviously don't want to do it. There's something wrong somewhere, even though I feel like I want to do it. It's just photo 500, it's just not gonna happen. The story that's involved with it, it's a story thing. It's a video, I have half of it shot. I just guess I just don't want to share it yet. Let's just move on. And plus, Having photo 500 be an eclipse just sounds better. <laughs> just It's just cooler. So that's what we're gonna do. But now that that's out of the way, I can actually start doing other things. Maybe I would be in the mood to do the video if the house was actually clean. Perhaps. Maybe that would help. Some people get a little depressed when the place is cluttered, but I don't really care. I mean, it's just me here. Why would I clean it? I mean, no, is, no, is anybody complaining? Are you complaining? If you do complain, I don't care, it's my house, get your own. Okay, I'm rambling, I'm thinking too much, help me. I just clean the house, that's step one. Clean the house so I can get everything ready to go. And then we go and watch an eclipse, okay? That's the plan, that's all I got. So, let's watch an eclipse. Greetings, we're a month away from the eclipse. It's a month away. I was thinking about what to do, like, I'm still processing how to like capture everything and not miss the moment for myself. I don't want to be like running around messing with a bunch of cameras because I kind of want to actually look at the thing, okay? <laughs> like it's a one-time thing. I have to look at it. So, so we'll use the normal zoom lens like what I used for the last eclipse 
in 4K, and then we'll have one of the other DSLRs with this terrible bazooka lens, which isn't gonna look that great, but it can get me closer, but it's not gonna look that great. So should I use 4K with that one then? But no, it's not gonna look that great anyways, because this is a terrible lens. So might as well just use one of the old cameras. So we could use the old DSLR, and then have like the newer one, the 5500, with me more vertical, like what I tried to do with the last eclipse. And then gotta remember to stop recording on the big camera that zoomed in on it and actually shoot a photo of the eclipse. Just at least one. I just wanna get a photo of it and then flip it back to recording. We'll have the GoPros going, so they'll get us video of us. That'll be the GoPros jobs because we have two of them. Anyways, I'm excited. You can tell. I am excited. The Polaroid. What if we shoot a Polaroid of the eclipse? Oh. <gasps> The Polaroid doesn't have any zoom. That's not gonna work. It'll be fine. It's gonna work out. It's gonna be a great day. It's gonna be clear. It's gonna have fun. We're gonna have fun. Okay? Okay? Okay. Ta-da. All done. Except for that. We'll, we'll deal with that in a second. But I do want to check the weather now that we're a week away. Wait, it's supposed to storm tonight? I do like storms. If you go back, you'll see a bunch of storm videos. I do record a storm every time it comes through. Well, I used to record every storm, but no, I don't really care. If it's good enough, yes, but if it's just like a rumble of thunder every like minute or so, it needs, no, I need more. I need more, like constant, like I'm going to die, maybe, that kind of stuff, yes. Earlier in the week, I did check earlier, like yesterday, it said it was gonna rain. And one of the websites still say it's going to rain. But three other websites say it's going to be Partly cloudy. Is it gonna rain? Is it not? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm concerned. We're four days out from the eclipse. Just checking the weather again, because it changed again. Now all four sites that I went to all say it's gonna be partly cloudy. Yeah, well, there's a little bit of a pocket where we are, like a pocket of nothing right there. So maybe, maybe, we'll see. We'll see. So we're gonna have some intermediate cloud bits, just like last time during the 2017 eclipse. Occasionally a cloud would come by and cover it up. But that was cool though, because then I could see the eclipse without the glasses. I could, the sun was being filtered through the cloud and I could just look up and just see it there. So that was cool. I kind of want to, when it actually happens, having clouds won't be good because then we won't be able to see the corona and the solar flares coming at us and blasting us and melting our face, you know? Ugh. I kind of want to see that happen. The lenses. Because I've got that zoom lens. I want to see what it looks like. I just want to see how close I can get and what it might look like when we're out there. The sun will be way up there. A little higher up than I thought, which means if I want to get a photo of me and the sun, the camera's going to be like... the filter. There it is. The sun. And here we are. 4K. Is the sun beautiful? Look how tiny it is. And now we zoom in. Whoa. Oh, that a sunspot. Ooh. You can see a sunspot. This is how close I'm going to be able to get with this camera, with this lens. This is what it's gonna look like. You can see a sunspot. There's definitely a sunspot right there. Well, now we have to see what it looks like with the other lens. Oh, right there. That sunspot became really clear right there. Okay, let it settle. There. How's that? That does work. That doesn't look too bad. We could use this lens on the 4K camera and see how it looks, just for fun. Boom. The sun. In 4K. Uh, with a terrible lens. There it is. The sun. Oh, anyways, 251. So it's almost time to set up these cameras. It's almost time. So we'll just zoom in from here. That's where it needs to be. That's all the zoom we're gonna have. So that's what it's gonna look like. It's gonna look like this, actually, you take it off. It's gonna look like that. So probably it's not gonna see anything, but it might as well just keep it here. I mean, the lens flare might turn into like a crescent shape because there's a lens flare going on. 
It'd be like a crescent lens flare. That'd be interesting. It is. What are you doing? Why do you look so old? Ugh. We we'll just have another one right here. Just hit record. And then when I leave, I'll say what time it is. So then in the video, because I'm not going to be here, so I won't know exactly when the eclipse happens. So I'll say what time it is, where I'm going to hit record. And then I can just use the video timeline to figure out how long it's been. If I leave at 10, it's been recording for an hour. That's 11. So if we want to get to 3 o'clock, five hours. There you go. It's time. I eclipsed the sun. Look, look, look. Ha. it's time. Here we go. I'll leave some cameras here to look at the sun to see what it looks like here. That's ten. Here, but there's no sun right there. There's the shadow, it's right there. It's coming in. Oh, yeah. Now's the time. Oh, it's still got a little teeny bit. Teeny bit. Teeny bit. Smaller. Smaller. Oh, it's a dot. Oh. Gone. There it is. Here we are, back home after 10 hours. Good heavens. That was fun, almost had a problem though. When I was shooting the photo, I didn't realize how dark it would get because you know I haven't been in an eclipse, but I thought it'd get like a little dim like this. No, no, it, it gets dark. So I like couldn't expose for me. If I were exposed for the eclipse, you couldn't see me. If I exposed for me, you couldn't see the eclipse. It'd be blown out, it looks just like a normal sun. So. <laughs> I still shot it anyways, so we might do a little cheating 
and we'll see what I can do with camera raw and try to like bring down the eclipse to be able to see something. Or we cheat a little bit and take the one photo I shot of the actual eclipse and the corona and all that, take that and just paste it in the photo. <laughs> and there you go. It's a little cheating, but eh. We were worried about the clouds, but it's a good thing they were there. They were like little faint, little wispy clouds way up there. And so it was cool because you could see the shadow come in because they were like reflecting and whatnot. So like, and then it went away and it looked like there was like a storm over there. That was cool. Oh, that was the cool part. And it got cold too. The ant didn't expect how cold it would get. It like got cold. It was, it was just, overall, I'm excited. I'm happy. That was cool. Here we are, a month later. I was kind of disappointed. I don't think I achieved what I wanted to achieve. The video that I hyped up, the 4K footage, you know who was recording this? I stopped, shot the photo, and I thought I hit record to start the camera back up. I did not. That's why you stop seeing this video right about here when the eclipse happens, because it's gone. I wasn't recording. I did the rookie mistake of not recording. But luckily, I had another camera. But then on that video, I cleaned the lens and there are specks everywhere. And it was windy and this lens doesn't have any stabilization. So it's just shaking around like all the footage I got. It's not good. And plus the photo that I got of the Eclipse, it's a new fancy camera and it's got two different modes. It's got photo mode and video mode. Like I'm used to just having just, you know, no mode. When I stop recording and I hit the shutter button on the old cameras, it would shoot a full photo. But in this camera, if it's in video mode and you shoot a photo, all it does is get a screenshot. It gets a 4K screenshot. It doesn't shoot a full frame 6,000 by 4,000 pixel thing. It just does 4K with no camera raw. That's all this is. So that's all I have. I mean, it's a good photo, but it's not, you know, full megapixels, all the camera raw, all this stuff. No, it's just a screenshot. <sighs> but do I need to be not happy? Like, so I didn't get any good video. Like, there's plenty of other videos. Look up Eclipse 4K, 8K, on here, on the YouTubes. You'll see a lot better stuff. It shouldn't matter that I didn't get it. Like, did I have to get it? No, like, I saw it. <laughs> like, that's all that matters, though, is that I saw it. So, like, <sighs> I don't know. Hello, greetings. I started recording from the phone, remote connected to the computer, and that fancy. I like the new shirts, by the way. They're, that's a vibe, look at this. And they smell weird. They, inside the package, they put a perfume scratch and sniff. And so like, <coughs> it smells weird. Let's just look at the photo again. Let me just see this again. Wonderful. Perfect photo, great. It's gorgeous. The best photo I've ever shot. It's beautiful. Okay, is something gonna work? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Is it out of focus? I don't think it's out of focus. It's just the high ISO makes it look out of focus because I just didn't expect it to get that dark. It went from this to this. And then their camera adjusted so it looks better. But it would but if the camera didn't adjust, it looked like that. That's what I had to fight with. We'll make it work. We'll make it work. The cameras I left at home. I wanna see those first. And the sun is right exactly where I thought it would be. Yes. I planned it out. Oh, I can see. Oh, oh, it's a crescent! Oh, look at that. It's a crescent shape. No way. It actually worked. Holy cow. I planned it out. Left the camera there, zoomed in, recording, and it actually worked. The sun is a little crescent shape. Oh, no way. Oh, you can see it move. You can see the moon move. Five hours and seven? There you go. It's peak eclipse right there. So does it actually get dark, though? Does anything happen? I mean, it is changing colors, but I don't think anything happened. I'm pretty sure it just... That's the UPS. Oh, that's the UPS guy dropping off these shirts. Is he actually there? 
did I just record the UP? Oh, I did. Oh, he must have felt so weird. <laughs> Walking up to this house, there's one camera looking at this guy, one camera looking at him. Oh, oh I'm so sorry. Oh, there it is. Oh, there it is. Well, you can see it on the GoPro, too. Look at that. You can see it. I should have shot a photo with the GoPro. I didn't want to get too distracted with a bunch of cameras, but I should have shot a photo with the GoPro. Oh, look at, oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Oh, you can see it. Oh, that's cool. Oh. And I almost didn't get the photo because here I am trying to like figure out what to do. I'm over on this camera trying to figure out what to do. And I shoot it at the last second, like right just as it's starting to get brighter is when I get the photo, right? Right there. I literally get it right at the last second because then boom, it's done. So I almost didn't get the photo. Like 30 seconds, almost didn't get the photo. Time out. ADD kicking in. I want cinnamon rolls. I want cinnamon rolls. I cleaned the house today. I actually cleaned the entire kitchen and everything else because I have all the stuff that I gathered over here for the trip and now I gotta put it somewhere so I cleaned all that up. I did stuff today. I did things today. I deserve a treat. I'm I'm gonna make cinnamon rolls. I'll be back in a second. Wait, time out. Um The cinnamon rolls expired in January. January fourteenth. Three months ago. Eh, we'll see. What's the worst that can happen? I blow up. Ha! Now it goes right to your thighs. Ha! I'm good. I'm fine. Hi. It's been a few days. Normally when I work on photos, I learned this in college. When you aren't sure about something and you're working on a photo, you know, that kind of stuff. Take a break. Just step away and then come back. So I usually, when I do these photos, I edit it and I just leave for a day or two, come back, look at it again, and see if it still works after everything resets. Because it might look good in the moment, but then after your brain resets and you forget about it and you come back, it might look a little different. This is what I did a few days ago. went from this to this. Re-edited it just now, so I went from this to this. And as you can see there's a little bit of a difference. Let's experiment. That. And go. Close enough. And put in generative fill. Solar eclipse. Did I spell eclipse right? Because I put the word solar. It's doing solar panels. Are you serious? Just eclipse. Let's see, that's a lunar eclipse. That's why I wanted to do solar. Well, there we go. That, that. Yeah. No, that's a lunar eclipse. That's a lunar. I, that's why I wanted, okay, we'll do total solar. But if I do solar, it's gonna put solar panels back in again. That's not total, that's just the sun. What's, what's with the line too? What's with this? Why is it doing a line in all of them? It's beautiful, AI, thank you. Thank you for your help. I appreciate it. Delete and delete. You tried. Yes. Oh, hi. Uh, we're not gonna do this again. I'm, I'll turn the lights on. Hold on. Sure, whatever. I had like three hours left in the video, in the raw files, and I just cut it all out because we went through a dilemma. I didn't know what to do with the photo. I pieced together two different ones. That was what the camera saw, and then one, what we saw. So I photoshopped in the eclipse. So this one was like what the camera saw, and then I photoshopped in the eclipse. And this is what we saw. And I also did one that was dark, because I darkened it, because that's how dark it was. But anyways, there was little versions, and I was just flipping between all of them, contemplating what to do, because 
She wants me to do the one where it looks like what we saw. But then I was torn on that because then I could just go out at any time at twilight and just Photoshop in the eclipse and I could just pretend like I was there. But at least with this one, it's all in camera and you can tell I was there. So that's... <sighs> I was torn between what to do. I've been in a depressive state for the past two months and I didn't want to work on anything. The video has been done for the past two months. I just didn't want to finish it. I just had to finish the editing part of the photo and then doing this part. I didn't want to. So this could have been done two months ago, but no, it wasn't. I was salty about the video too, how I didn't record the eclipse. I got over it, I think. Well, well, here I am. I mean, obviously I am, I'm over something. But uh, anyways, I'm still debating. I still actually haven't decided on what to do. Even the fake one though does look pretty good. Like I'm zooming in on it. It's got the correct pixels and whatnot. It looks crunchy, just like the photo. You can see the JPEG artifacts. It's on the Eclipse too. And it, <laughs> I, I did a pretty good job putting it in there. You know, you think it would just be easy just slide it in, put it there. But no, there's like, hold on. I'll go look at the file. Hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven layers in this photo, seven layers. I'm going with it. And this one. I'm doing it. And that's it. That's it. We're just going to do it. Finally, this Eclipse video is done. <laughs> Sorry it took so long. Plus, we got all the new people. There was new people coming in. YouTube was sharing the video for 15 years. We were getting people. It would have been nice to get it up right then and there. Was, the momentum was going. But no! I had to be all salty and just grumpy. All right, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. So, I don't know when the next project will be. I thought this one was gonna be done pretty quick, but no! It... I do have a back catalog of stuff that's been recorded for the past two months. There was a bird kept trying to fly in the window. The neighbor died. That was interesting. The stuff with the house, the loan, the mortgage. Something happened. I almost lost the house. It's been a fun time. And then there's Photo 500, the original Photo 500 that I wanted to do, that I didn't do, that I'm pushing off. I'm just a mess. It's a mess. Everything. I'm just, I'm doing two things. This is why I just don't do anything. I'm doing too many things. So I just stop. I just don't do anything. I'm, just, I'm rambling. I'm done. I'm done. This video's already too long. I'm done. I'm done. It's over. I'm done. Okay. I'm out. Peace. I'll see you when I see you. I, 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 I don't know.